bet you all know that feeling. You go to sleep, it's really late, but you just can't fall asleep because there's a big event waiting for you at the next day. You're lying in your bed, trying to manage your thoughts and hope they finally go silent. But they don't. You're just too excited for the next day. Well, let's just say I wouldn't consider my last night silent. But anyway, it passed and we reached our first destination. Here we are. Oh, do you see that? Let's uh, let's get closer. They are... pink. Why is that? No idea. All I know is that they're water geezers. Don't get too close. I, uh... I can't promise you that. Um, Zach? I wouldn't do that. Don't do that. <sighs> Woo! Yeah! <sighs> like a six-year-old. Zach, are you alright? So. Now that we took a morning shower, we're getting closer to Louis Loss. This place is interesting. Apparently there was a doctor called Louis, who was the owner of this facility. One day, a co-worker found something, something strange. We were able to get our hands on some odd locks of this facility. Zach's going to read them for you. Personal log, entry one. It was here a few days ago, I swear. Dr. Lewis said I'm not lucky to be fired for dragging them all out here. But it was right here. The proof that they existed. Someone must be messing with me. There's no way that much data can be corrupted without leaving a trace. This can't be right. There seems to be a signal hidden in the corrupted data. I didn't see it before, and if the data hadn't been ruined, I might never have seen it. I found it. They all think I'm crazy, but I found it. It's definitely not a natural signal or background noise. I've run every test that I can think of, and it all confirms that it's not natural or in human origin. I'm afraid to tell anyone about the signal. After last time, Dr. Lewis is reluctant to believe anything. I did it. I told Dr. Lewis and this time, I had the proof. Everyone seemed really excited about it. Dr. Lewis is even sending a special report to command. We might even get some extra grant money out of this. Cleaner Team 26 reporting in. Company Directive 3650 in effect. All data regarding research project under Dr. Lewis is now classified. All assets have been processed. Seems like they discovered an alien signal, doesn't it? Agreed. You think... Thargoids? Hmm. It might be related to the Guardian Ruins that got discovered half a year ago, don't you think? But I guess that's a story we're going to discuss on a later journey. My father was working on a science outpost too, you know. A planetary settlement in Seoul. I think it was called... Harbor Lance Survey. On Europa. What did you do for a living? drilling and taking probes off the moon's surface mostly. Nothing too fancy. But he told me one story again and again. It really stuck in my head. 
He said there was one incident where they had to stop the whole drilling platform because something screeched. Screeched? Yeah. Every time they drilled, the ground started to rumble and a high screeching noise appeared. They couldn't find the problem, but it solved itself a day after. They tried again and it was gone. No one knew what happened. Anyways, he told me it was like a ghost story. Like some creature was living down there and they were drilling in its armature, making a screech. Wasn't going to sleep tonight anyway? <laughs> Don't worry. It was probably just some metal they drilled in. Or, or was it? Well, that was interesting. Especially like the part where I tried to scare me with the little ghost story. Tried? <laughs> Pretty sure I did. No, you didn't. I did. Okay, you did. Anyway, what's uh, our next destination? Yeah, we'll reach our 1000 light year mark away from Seoul, visiting the Fine Ring Nebula. Hmm. You wouldn't believe how beautiful that place is. I can't wait. Me neither. Hey guys, thanks for watching. I just wanted to let you know how grateful I am for all your feedback to the series. Uh, this whole concept is something I've been having in mind for a really long time and seeing how it's getting appreciated by you guys is really great. Especially because this is my first big project I'm doing in English instead of German, so I'm really happy that this works out. Um, if you want to know more about the series, for example on how far I am with editing the upcoming episodes, uh, take a look at the description below. I started a forum post where you can find information about the series as well as status reports and so on. And we also uh, launched a Facebook page where I uh, occasionally share some pictures and behind the scenes stuff with you. So yeah, uh, check that out if you want and uh, yeah, see you in the next episode. This rock defeated me first. <laughs> oh, <What>? Christ! <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, you... Yeah, goodbye. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> God, baby, God! <laughs> You're almost 2.5 kilometers away. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Oh my god. And my ship started flying away. Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> it noped out. <laughs> it, it just went to fucking light speed. <laughs> <laughs>